So the reason why the quarter inch adapter is important is because we can just connect it up to a typical quarter inch uh, male uh, adapter. And in this case I purchased an air regulator that allows me to regulate the air at the source rather than having to go back to the air compressor to do it. One thing you're going to need is some PTFE tape, also known uh, incorrectly as Teflon tape. So here you have the valve for adjusting the pressure and this will allow you to uh, keep the pressure on the supply end. It has an arrow. You may not be able to see it because of reflection. It shows airflow. The arrow is in this direction. So air comes in and goes out. What that means is since the airflow goes in this direction, I need to have the input on this side and the hose is connected on this side. And this is the hose that gets connected to the airbrush. Got a nipple that will allow me to connect the uh, two females together. PTFE tape, if we want to use this quick connect, then we have this end here that we need to connect. So. This is probably fine because this is going to connect to my hose. Because the air goes in this direction, this is the supply. The air supply goes here. So all I need to do is run some PTFE tape around this. And the way you do this, so the, the part screws on this way, here, because it's right thread. So you take and you start it on this side, and you hold the tape in this fashion so it comes off this way. You get it started, and don't drop it like I did. and you run it around a couple times. And then pull it tight. Get any of the extra out of the way. Because we don't want that clogging up anything. And then we install our adapter on there. So this goes on real easy, it's not going to leak. You'll want to tighten it down with a pair of pliers. Now on this side we need to install the nipple. Here's our nipple. They call it a coupling. Everybody in plumbing knows it as a nipple. Okay, so we can connect this just like this, but I'm not going to do that. First, I'm going to run the PTFE tape around it on both sides. Again, start on that side and run around this way. Same thing again.
Easiest way to remember is it's right thread. Hold the part to your right, pointing towards the right. Use your right hand and go on the bottom to the top. One pass, two passes, that's enough. Pull tight. Okay, we're gonna make sure that we get all the excess out of the way. Now we can make our connection. This does not have to look pretty, it just has to be functional. Let me make this connection here. Okay, now that might not work. I have a feeling there's gonna be some leakage here. So I may need to get a different type of connector. Because I think when I hook this up, it's gonna leak. So we have a couple options. Let me first undo it. Trying to tell if there's a rubber boot around that or not. So this is on the airflow side, it might work. It might be fine because I think there's a rubber boot around it, but it's loose. Let's see what happens when we install this guy. He's very tight. Okay, so that's the difference. So, I can go really uber complicated on this, in which we'll have this, and what's this go to, this guy here. Only because... This guy isn't deep enough. Maybe. Okay, as I suspected, this is not going to work. So I'm going to kludge this up. This is not the way to do this. This is just because I. this is what I have. Really need to get a better nipple, so I'm gonna do that. I'll go to the uh, hardware store and pick up a better nipple. Or I could actually go down the plumbing section. So that's a nice tight fit there. All right, now, this is the crazy part. So I'll take this, put him here, and then we'll do this here. Yep, this is uber crazy. And then this is the part that gets connected to the air hose for the supply. Supply, airflow, and then this gets connected to the the sprayer.
Okay, when you're done, put away your PTFE tape. So this little pressure regulator, yeah, it worked, but it's a bit of a headache because you need the correct uh, male quarter inch connector on this side so that this closes properly so that there's no leaking. 